Hey guys, Popfloid plays here, back at it again with some more Galaxy, and we're on to the next ship in our list to review. And that would be, oh, by the way, just saying here, Kraken, get it, as, as soon as you can, if you can. They put it on the build menu from a quest. And it's different, but it's still got generally the same stuff, and it's large torpedoes. And, uh, yeah, I'm just saying get that if you want. They're probably going to put it as a quest eventually, and you might not be able to get it again. And for those of you who used to have one, but couldn't get one again, now you can get it. Alright, but anyways, we are on to the next ship in our list. Not a battle cruiser. I opened the wrong one. Uh, the, a battleship. That would be the Warden. Just... Actually, wait. What, what are they fighting over there? Missing out on some real fightage. I heard a torpedo. What's a, what's going on? Oh, they're fighting Dracos again. Oh, blue is starting to occupy Mega though. All right, let's uh wrap this up before we lose control of Mega. Let's grab ourselves some Palladium, Titanium, Quantium, and a Warden. All right, guys, let's. Go back to our base and spawn. That's loud. Ah, oh, and laggy. All right, all right. Our warden terminal B. Boy, let's see this. I've heard it doesn't look like uh, you know the best ship, but still. Wow, they have a ridge break. Before we get in the warden, I'm just gonna go check out the ridge breaker because I've never actually seen the current ridge breaker interior. I want to know if it has one or if it's just a. Ah, uh, yeah, that's about what I expected. So sad, so sad indeed. All right, but let's check out the warden. I heard this was like the most larger ship PVP one. I'm I'm assuming it's gonna be like the rest of the ships, just kind of garbage, no interior. I can't even. Oh, oh wow, oh wow, this is actually really good. That took me by surprise. This is about. There's a console right there. All right, so let's see what this thing has. Oh, oh, whoa, lag. Seventy speed, pretty decent turn speed. Like, really good, actually, for a ship its size. It seems like eight medium phasers. I need to... No, four medium phasers. Alright. Oh, wow, it has triple heavies! Oh, whoa, whoa. Dual mediums and triple heavies? Oh, hey, and a light. Alright. Oh, whoa! Whoa, whoa, guys! This thing is decked on the underside, too! Like, no blind spots! <laughs> Holy crap! Oof. Right. Oh, wow, and we actually have some lasers for once. The new ships didn't seem to have lasers, but now this one does have lasers as turrets. Alright, so let's check it out, guys. Oof. This thing's as big as an... This thing is as big as an apocalypse, my goodness. But then again, you need to remember that apocalypse is tiny and still packs a huge punch. Probably deals more damage than this. Alright, so this thing was cheap for like 30k. So, 4,000 shields, 2,000 hull. That's 1,000 hull more than the last ship we reviewed, the katana. Pretty decent speed for... Uh, medium phasers. Let's see. So, this thing has some... Oh, what the... This thing has some... Triple... Heavy... Okay, okay, so it's got a triple heavy... Cannon. Yeah, it's got two triple heavy cannons. 
some dual medium lasers, and a light Gatling on the bottom. Alright, so here's the light Gatling, here's the two dual mediums, and the rest are all, uh, or dual, he triple, alright, so, bottom has, so it has one light Gatling laser, two triple heavy cannons, and the rest are dual medium lasers, I think that's four. Yeah, four dual medium. That, that's pretty good. This thing is a really good ship. Let's warp over to uh, Mega and see if we can't find ourselves a fight. Yeah, click, click, click. A nice ship. I think I warped to... Uh, too short. Oh, but not as short as that guy did. All the wrecks that I just want you for my own. Gonna have to mute that, sorry guys. I don't want any songs. Copyright strikes find even small YouTube channels. Oh, but it looks like we're gonna push free on though. So maybe, just maybe we won't be uh Ah, oh, but that might be an upgraded. If that's an upgraded Freon, do you guys know all the turrets it's going to have? Like, they added 21 heavy turrets to Freon. So, we're just going to storm it, I guess. I definitely warped too close. Oh no, but they're already there, so hopefully unless I... Ah, oh, that's nice. Is the music still there? Yep, it's still there. This thing's got a nice trail to it as well. Oh, hey, Genesis, nice. You guys should get a Genesis if you don't already have one. I think I did a ship review on it. It's pretty, uh, pretty good. In just a moment, we're going to be getting within range of where we can fire off our heavies. Not 7k, of course, but... Oh, the Nyx is here? Wow. You know what? Screw it. I don't care. I'm you know who I am. I'm too hot. Hot damn. You know what? Never mind. That's Girl. just no. This is actually pretty good. Not pretty nice. I'd say this is more of a heavy ship, he heavy ship PvP, like fighting other capital ships or larger battle cruisers. Oh, what? Oh, we we took it. You see, that's what I get for turning the volume off. Well, in that case, let's take a look on Freon. Take a look at Freon. Then we'll despawn and get to the console. Hopefully that foul music is Damn. No, it still is. It's the console that's playing it, I think. <sighs> How disappointing. But anyways, the interior at least is really good. It's small, but nice. Oh, no, 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 no. Get in. I jumped. Dang it. <laughs> Whoa, what the heck is this thing? Is this the new heavy long range they're talking about? They said they added some new turrets. That's all I can think of. 
So they already added long-range lasers, I think, in the same update that the Executioner came out with the point defenses and the uh, rapid-fire lasers, but, like, they added heavy long-range lasers, I believe. Although I don't know the names of the other ones. But, uh, yeah, that's been... That's been the Warden battleship. Costs about 30k, 30,000, uh, credits. Not much else to say about it. Alright, I'm just gonna end the ship review here on... That's a lot of turrets. I'm gonna end the ship review here on top of this turret right here. And I'll see you all in the next video. Pop Floyd Plays, signing out.